Hello. <laughs> I am back with I am here back with some more breakfast. I cannot speak this morning. And it has had quite a massive update. You might notice that the uh, menu looks slightly a bit different. Um, apparently the console version of the game was just recently released. And with it were brought some new cars and some new tracks. And I'm here to look at that. What was also announced is a season pass. So I don't really know much about this sort of stuff. But the way I understand it working is... You pay the price once, and then as the DLC are released, you get them either for less or for free. I'm not sure which, as the first season pass DLC hasn't actually come out yet. So I guess I and anyone else who doesn't know how they work will find out that. Um, but at the moment, it is, I think, 20% off. So if you want to grab the season pass, I'd advise grabbing it now. In fact, there's a DLC store thing right here on the front page. Look at that. That's convenient, isn't it? So yeah, so this is the the season pass. You'll get various new cars and such. I'm just looking at the wingman over here. That, to me, looks ex it looks vaguely like a Plymouth Fury, maybe. And I quite like that. And a Beetle. How to Ford something? I forget. Is that a Model A? Oh, it's a hot rod anyway. I don't know what that is. And this car just looks like another version of the Challenger that we already have. Oh, my. Anyway, so yeah, that's that. I I'm not really here to talk about that stuff. Good. Press the wrong button. There we go. Because this is sort of my first look playing it myself, but it is not my entirely first look because I watched... Fail Race's video on the console version that he put out recently. And there was one thing that I noticed in his video that I want to go and have a look at myself. Uh, sure, this one looks like a track that I don't like. Guess I might as well drive this, seeing as it's new and all. And if we go down to AI vehicles. See, there are all sorts of new stuff. Big rig. This is the one I want to look at first. Because I'm very curious as to it. And I'm going to just knock it down from realistic damage, because I probably won't survive if I keep that up there. Already... Oh. Was Elimination Race already in, always in the game? I'm not actually sure. And keep all that the same. Hopefully my setting, or my controls are still right. And let's jump right into it. Alright, now as usual I'll be cutting the loading times out, but they're not actually that bad. The first, like, 5% takes a little while, and then after that it just shoots up. Alright, I'm probably going to have a very bad time with this, because this is going to be a fast car that I'm going to have trouble controlling. <laughs> Let's just jump right into it. Oh my. Uh, shoot. Hold on. Oh, okay. Don't know where the course is. All I can see is a bunch of trucks. Holy moly! Whoa! I gotta say, those are not quite what I was expecting. Uh. I thought we were just gonna have, like, normal, like, road trucks. I didn't realize they were gonna be race trucks. It's brilliant. Whoa!
Okay, I definitely shouldn't have started with a car that I've never driven before. <laughs> I'm curious to know what place I end up coming in. Um, in case I never mentioned it, or more people watch this video than watch my previous Rockfest videos, I play without the UI on because I find it distracting. <laughs> or without the HUD on, rather. That's the word for it. But I believe there is a new game map if you do have the HUD on. So, what a problem of this video will probably be is I'll race the new vehicles, like, I'll race against the new vehicles, because I haven't gotten far enough through the story mode to have unlocked them. Um, or the career mode, I guess. I will say, the game seems to be running a little bit better than it used to, because I seem to remember back when I used to record this game, I would constantly be complaining about frame rate issues, and at the moment I'm not really having any. Uh, what? Okay, that wasn't the button I wanted. <laughs> My car didn't seem to want to go in reverse. I think there might have been something behind me. And hopefully I'll get a little bit better at driving this as I continue to drive it. Because it just takes me a second to get used to the physics in this game. I'm used to more arcade style. I feel like... Okay. Probably should have shifted down then. Fifteen. That was... <laughs> actually, for the first race of the day, that actually wasn't too bad. <laughs> now, this, I believe, is a new track. Open circuit sounds fun to me. I'm going to keep this car, because I actually do quite like this car. But yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just... Like, a slightly different version of this car, isn't it? Well, yeah, it is, because it's the Bandit Ripper. I mean, don't get me wrong, this is a brilliant car. You know, I love the Challenger. So, I guess this one... Oh, interesting, with the modified... My... my with the modifications I have on the regular Bandit, the Ripper is actually a lower A-class. I'll have to fix that at some point. Alright, so let's see what other interesting things we have. So the Double Decker was already in the game, the Harvester was already in the game, the Lawnmower was already in the game, the Motorhome was not, the School Bus was, the Sofa Car was not, and I'm really interested in Mixed and Special Vehicles Mix. Alright, so I guess next we'll do the Motorhome. And I see Motorhome and I just think of that one like RV race that Top Gear did. And that makes me very excited. I'm hoping it'll end up like that. And hopefully I'll be able to start this one a little better. Because I'll actually be able to shift at the start.
Yes, they're old Fords. I think, actually, no, those more, look more like... I was thinking they were going to be like Ford F-150 front ends, but it looks more like an old Chevy van, maybe. Uh, I literally have nowhere to go, and I don't know where the track goes, so that's fine. Oh, I'm being pitted by an RV. This is chaotic already. Uh, what button changes the camera? I forget. Is it this one? No. Ah. I feel like I've already lost quite a lot of my car. That's not the right gear. I now see the error of my ways. I should have brought the, uh, the mud digger. Oh my goodness. It actually does kind of look like... Well... Well, that's not helpful, is it? Right, I'm going back to first person. I can't drive like this. Oh, this is really skinny. Look at this little. Okay. If my voice keeps changing volume levels or something, by the way, my mic stand seems to be falling apart. <laughs> Oh, look at that! <laughs> it's not really an RV anymore. It's kind of a flatbed now. Now, what would be brilliant, because I actually saw a banger race once where the focus was on making sure your trailer stays alive. It was a bunch of cars pulling trailers. It'd be cool if they could work that into this game at some point. I don't know if they have the coding available to have an articulation point, but if they could do that that and then maybe even add a bendy bus that would be brilliant oh that's a bit too much gas oh okay well now i can't use first person all right go up here uh. oh too much gas again Okay, that was just rude. Oh my goodness. There's not really much truck left there, is there? Look at the front. Look at the front. <laughs> These RVs are brilliant. I want one. I believe there's also a limousine. Because that's what uh, Ferris was using. Unless that's like a console version exclusive, maybe. I don't know. Well, I was really just excited for the big rigs, honestly. But that limousine he was using was quite brilliant. So I'd like to see that one available as well. But I don't know how you'd go about unlocking that. Ah, wrong computer. It is surprising. You'd think an A-Class car would be able to easily beat a bunch of motorhomes. But just finding a way past them is quite difficult. I say as I pass three. Oh, that was the end. <laughs> that was not me. That was the AI. <laughs> Surprise, surprise, I think I got best lap. Who'd have thought? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Who'd have thought I'd get best lap in my muscle car? Oh, oh continue. This 
this game is absolutely brilliant. If you don't already have it, I really, really advise you get it. Especially now, I like to think that a lot of my audience is Big Truck fans. I don't know if that's true, but I like to think that it is. Um, you know, now we have a Big Truck in the game that you can go and smash into other Big Trucks. How fun is that? Alright, I believe there's one more... Well, there's the sofa car, but I don't really want to race against that, because that'll just... Well, it'll be... I just had a brilliant idea. I want to do this, first of all, because there's a loop-de-loop. -loop. Um, I'm going to race the sofa car in my super van. I don't actually remember what class the sofa car is. Yes. I can't believe the super van is class B. Just make sure, yeah. This should be amusing. If you haven't seen the sofa car, it is brilliant. So sorry for the chewing commentary. I was trying to finish my breakfast. Uh, I forgot this shit. <laughs> so, what we're learning here is the sofa car is faster than my Reliant. No, oh, no. I'm not sure if this car is going to make it up this. How is this car B class? Yeah, that's a no. Uh, and we're across. Good. I've actually only driven this car one other time. So oh, it is quite odd, and now it's pulling. And I also keep hitting my hand on my on my. Uh, Oh, my mic. <laughs> uh, that gear? Is that a good gear? I don't like this car. <laughs> uh, shoot. But you, I mean, the course itself here is brilliantly chaotic. This mix of vehicles, not so much. I was expecting this to be a bit more entertaining, to be honest. No, this this car just cannot make the jump. Uh-oh. And quite, <laughs> quite poorly. I did not expect that to kill me. <gasps> oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh, he <you> just. <laughs> oh, but okay. The combination of the sofa cars in that course was brilliant. My reliant mixed in was not a great idea. <laughs> Right, so to finish off, I'm going to go to here, because I hear that this track is quite brilliant. I think most of the special vehicles are Class C, so I'm going to take my Mud Digger, which I don't think I've actually driven yet. 
and I'm going to make the AI class special vehicles mixed because I find I think that'll be quite amusing as well. Right, let's just jump into it. Oh, <laughs> a double decker and a harvester. That's funny. Oh, I've been attacked by something. Oh, that's my lookbackers button. Are there not any? Uh, everyone's checking up and the harvesters hit something. Are there not any semis? Dang, that's annoying. I did see a school bus, though. Yeah, the school bus, I think, is actually leading at the moment. Ah! Hello, RV. Where'd you come from? Oh! I forgot about that. I forgot about that. I've screwed up. And now I'm down here. I'm gonna just restart, reset quickly. I'm sorry, by the way, if you don't like the first-person camera. I have trouble driving with a steering wheel in third person. Wow, I can actually take that corner flat out. Uh. Alright, don't fall off the course this time. truck is not very fast, is it? Alright, come on. I can't be beaten by a school bus. Land on it. Land on it. Oh, I did land on it. <laughs> I actually want to go this way for once. Uh Just annihilated my mic then. I shifted too quickly. By the way, um, now that I can actually record this without too much frame rate drop, if you want to see some of the career mode, uh, just let me know and I'll record some of that because I am going to be playing through the rest of it. I definitely want to unlock some of these special vehicles now. <coughs> I think something's buckled at the front end. The truck is suddenly not very good at landing in the jumps. Oh, shoot! Uh-oh. Ow. 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 Let's see if I can get back up the side. Oh, it just reset me automatically. Okay. Bro, the bus is beached! <laughs> well, I'm not gonna get beat by the bus anyway. And that's the end. <laughs> Thirteenth. Okay. I mean, that was an absolutely chaotic race. And, yeah, I actually wasn't the fastest. So I guess when it says special mixed, it means it's just mixed, but some of the vehicles are special vehicles. I assumed it was going to be all special vehicles, but some of them were going to be... Or, but they were going to be mixed up, rather. Nope. Alright, well, I'd say that'll about do it. Uh... <laughs> This update is brilliant, and I mean, the game was always brilliant, but now I can actually record it easier, so there'll probably be more of it on the channel, because I do love this game, and this update gives me just the reason to get back into it. So thank you for watching, and let me, like I said, let me know in the comments if you want to see me playing through some of the career mode, because I will happily do so. And goodbye.
That was... I like, I like bowed with the mouse then. 